Hey guys, it's Joshy here, and I'm here to show you how to get three and four star photographs of Caterpie in the new Pokemon Snap. Now, before I get into it, there may be slightly different methods or anything other than the ones I'm showing you that I don't know about or aren't discovered yet, but these are guaranteed to give you both. Now, the reason I'm doing three and four and not one and two is because one and two stars are pretty simple. One, usually boring. Two, doing a simple eating action or getting hit with a fluff fruit and getting a bonked action shot. So... They're pretty straightforward. Now you do have to go to the park at night to do this. Uh, this is due to the fact that Caterpie only appear at night. Now there are a couple methods to get four stars, but there is only one to get three. And I'll show you both. I would also suggest in your settings having your burst mode on to make sure you don't miss the three star opportunity. You can go up to four or six if you want. I will go to six for this just to make sure I don't miss it. And we're going to go along. This is not important. I'm just doing that because I can. Generally, you want to get over here. And you can see the canopy over here. And I threw the wrong thing. And you don't actually have to do this, I understand. You run a scan. Once you're close enough, if you're lucky, after the canopy reacts to a scan, it will start using string shot. And it didn't. But it can, and I will show you a photo afterwards of it doing so. But using a scan on a Caterpie can make it start using String Shot, and that will then give you the opportunity to uh, photograph it for a four star. As you saw, it jumped in reaction to the Murkrow flying over. That is your three star opportunity. Now, I will continue through here quickly to get to the other side of the, um, this level, but if I get to the other side, I can clearly show you your four-star opportunity, which actually is a lot easier to get because it isn't by chance at all. It will happen if you do the right things every time. Um, I personally love both because Caterpie is adorable and cute, but you have to just be lucky to get the string shot. If you wanted to, though, if you go to a level one uh, map, instead of anything higher the Murkrow don't swoop over so you can actually still get them to react now to get the last one all we have to do is play the music here while we're near the sign and these beautiful little caterpie pop out behind the sign there that is also a mission given to you to finish now i'm going to quit my research here instead of bothering with the rest but if you wish to you can so let me go through this quickly. I'm only going to submit one um, canopy. As we can see, there's our three-star holy crap jumping canopy, and there's our four-star cutie canopies. I'm going to just put a four-star in, just because I can, because it's barely going to add any time to this. And actually, I don't have a string shot one to put in because I actually haven't, because I overrode it with that. So going through at level 1 again, this time, not level 2, we can go forward, we're just going to speed up through here a bit. Make the shaman up. Now all you have to do really is run a scan and it's as simple as that, he just reacts to the scan. Now, look at this, it's not guaranteed to happen every time. Sometimes they will, sometimes they won't. There is no exact method, I've tried multiple ones. You might find music guarantees it, you may find it doesn't, but that's how it goes. As I said, burst mode on is your best option. But anyway, guys, if you did enjoy this content or would like to check out anything else I do, my YouTube channel is a good place to start. A lot of playthroughs, a lot of Pokemon content. Plus, I am trying to do every Pokemon in this game. I will get to do it in the end. Uh, if you do have a Pokemon you'd like me to do earlier and I haven't done it yet, do comment and I will get to it sooner, as long as I can. Uh, also, if you'd like to check out Twitch, I did stream this whole game on Twitch and do a lot of stuff there, and I always appreciate people just coming and hanging out. But anyway, guys... Until my next video, I'll see ya.